Here we are with episode 2 of uh, Black Mesa, the Half-Life uh, 2 mod for the original Half-Life Source. I'm continuing on right where I left off. Um, for those of you who probably don't know, I just got a new mic just within about an hour ago. I got my new Yeti microphone. As you can see, the sound quality is outstanding, and you can actually hear me a lot better versus my headset, which was I used on the previous episode. So with that said, I am nice, sound, high-quality HD uh, commentary, finally. Um, this microphone was about a hundred so dollars. I bought a pop filter with it, but I just am shocked at how much crispier, crispier the sound quality is compared to my other microphone, which always seem to always have audio picking problems, but... I don't remember or not, um, in the original Half-Life, could you sprint? I don't recall being able to sprint, but in this Half-Life, um, 2 mod source, you apparently you can sprint, s such as this. Oh, I hate the load times. I mean, even in an original Half-Life, we were always having these dumb load times, but, hey, such as life, it's a great game, so I can, I can, I can take the what, 30 second load times every so often. But yeah, I like to be able to sprint. But I don't remember being able to sprint in the first game, but... Refresh my memory. Oh, fuck. Okay. Those head crawler things are... Oh! Oh! Alien piss! Green piss, or whatever! Man, that is so... Look at that. Look at that green ooze on my crowbar. That... That... You see, that... That didn't happen in the other game. That's what's so awesome about this. It's like all redone and revamped. From alone, in the water we go. part in this game where there's like this gigantic fish that tries to eat you. I don't remember if that's a level or not, but I think it's in this game. Maybe I'm thinking of a different game. I get so many games confused. Look at all those termites. Or bugs or flies or something. I don't know what they are. Nothing like just making more blood come out of a person's body. Holy shit tits. Look at that. Dude, look at my gun. That's freaking awesome. It has like that greenish glow. It looks like, oh, what's it called? Um, those glow sticks? Mm, yum, yum. Man, I love the, I just love the new Glock sound with the guns. Oh. Blow up. Come on, come on. Why take it so long? Nothing over here, okay. Uh, as you can probably tell, my voice is actually getting better. I'm still somewhat congested from being sick the past week, but... It's getting... Know your fire exits. Well, when you make a hallway that looks like that, I would imagine it would be really hard to find your fucking exit when you have that many turns. What's black and white, and should I... And should be red all over? I don't know. Hmm. <coughs> Caution. Full, fall hazard watch your step. Crane in operation. Wear hearing, earring protect, hearing protection. Oh, I remember this. I died. So, no, I didn't die. I kept falling. I remember this segment. It's so annoying. I'm all, I always suck at these parts in video games where I have to jump. And jump from stuff, thing to thing. I just... I have no gaming skill when it comes to these type of methods of having to jump around. As you will probably witness here, but let's see if I can actually do it. Excuse me. I don't think I need to get over there. Uh, 
Oh, fuck. As I was mentioning earlier, I normally suck at these type of things. Alright, yeah, I skip, 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 since yeah, I probably- I died about 15 times, I'm just- I just suck at this type of stuff, so... To spare you the waiting time. I may be good with a gun, but I'm good with- terrible with my feet. They've never made a whole lot of sense to me. They just randomly spawn and shoot these stupid wave things. I hate them. They're probably the most annoying things in this game, I think. In my opinion. That's effective. Blow yourself up. That's one way to do it. Yeah, I definitely like the ability to sprint. Pull hander handle to open door in emergency. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Loading, 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 loading. I could probably do a quick masturbation session while this thing's loading, but I will refrain because I need my hands on my keyboard, and I don't want to have to clean up my keyboard either. So I'll refrain from doing so. <laughs> Office complex. Ooh, yum, 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 yum. Hello? Oh, Who's the guy there? on the left's dead. Look at that. The black guy- the black guy always dies first. Why is it? Like, in movies, in anything, it's always the black guy who always gets killed. I don't understand. Do they discriminate against video game characters in that way? I've never understood why they do that. I mean, how many times have I? Has anyone seen the movie uh, Deep Blue Sea? Uh, it had Samuel L. Jackson in it. I remember it's terrible, uh, terrible, terrible movie. But I remember the movie mainly because of how Samuel L. Jackson randomly was standing um, by this hole in the base, and a gigantic shark just jumps oh, out and Gordon. rips his half of his if body I'd known in it half. Was you, I would have let you in. And it was just Everybody's like one of those WTF moments. You're like, what just happened? But, and then in Star Wars Episode 3, I mean, come, come on. Us. Samuel L. Jackson gets right. his hand chopped off and blown out a window. How sad is that? I mean, it's freaking Mace Windu, for God's sake. Mace Windu is one of the most powerful Jedi in the Star Wars universe. And he can't even do it. Holy mother of poo. That guy came out of nowhere. Lifty made easy. Hey, hey, over here. I need your help. 
Oh my gosh, it's a One human of these being. Buggers latched onto my buddy's head. We gotta get that thing off before. Behind you, hey. idiot! Just arrived. Thanks. You, you just stood there like a moron. Uh, here, let me get this open. I, uh, I got some supplies in the back. If you want, uh, go take a look, see, see what you can carry. Well, thanks for the help, you moron. Even. Ah, the trusty Magnum. Ooh, and look at that. That's a new feature. We can actually look down the sight of the gun. I got blood all over my hands. Ooh, I love it, I love it, I love it. Well, I didn't know I could pick these guys up. Hmm, awesome, though. Hi. Oops! Well, you can see the, the shock value that did on him. Nothing like the good old Magnum to put a bullet through someone's head. Power, 15%. I don't think there's anything else left in this. Okay, so there's really... I gotta get in here, that's what I remember. I don't recall how to... Oh, I remember this now. I died a lot at this section. Oh, that's there. That kind of made me jump. But I remember there was a part of this game where those they, they they just sit in the vents and it scares the living crap out of you. So I expected that to some extent. Look at that! I will think just God damn these stupid face huggers! I hate them. One bullet doesn't. One bullet kills you. I forgot about those things. Did 
Did I just I just went in a bloody circle. So a circle. Can't speak. Blah, 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 blah. What the? Where did they guys those guys just walk back here and they just randomly spawn out of nowhere? Load, 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 load. Time to take a sip of my apple juice. Uh, I slurp just to piss you off, so don't worry. I, uh, I heard screams up ahead. Uh, you first. No, quite frankly, I want your pistol. Thank you. You're useless anyway. The guys in this game have never been helpful to begin with. Minor lacerations. That looks like a really uncomfortable position. Blue screen of death again. Even in video games. I've got you! I've got you! <laughs> yummy, yummy, yummy in my tummy, tummy, tummy. Wow, look at that. Still bleeding. Periodic table of elements. I don't, I don't, it's been so long since I've played this, I just... Time. Don't worry, he's human. If you're trying to escape, I'm coming with you. I'm How about you not come so on sure me? we should go to the surface. What if the world finds out what we're doing down here? Suit yourself, Clifford. All right, which way out of here? Follow me, bitch. Thank you. Good show. I can show some other things if you'd like. You're pretty hot. You should take down that blouse. Unbutton. One, two, three. You only got a few buttons. Undo your zipper. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Show me, show me. Give me some action. But that's right. Gordon is a man of very few words, so that would never happen. Power 15%. I trust there's a reason for all this dilly-dallying. Unless you want to dilly-dally me. You're more than welcome, sweetheart. Pardon me. Don't forget to reload. Already? Uh, please excuse me. Ah, apple juice tastes so wonderful. 
Come on, load up. That's right, you stay there, Missy. Perhaps you should ready more bullets? Yeah. I should ready more bullets. Thanks for the advice, miss. I don't understand the correlation between Half-Life 2 and these guys are your friends versus, um, this game where they're their, you're, you're their enemies and they don't really, they're not explained as to why you need to kill them. Kind of sucks is they don't put um, items in the stuff like they used to in Half-Life 2. Put items and health and stuff in the boxes, but they don't do it in this game. Run, sprinting, always suck at it. Run and sprint. There we go. Pretty sure there's nothing down here, but let's... Yeah, that's nothing. Let's take a peek. Head jumper? Nope. There's a part in this game I remember where I'm going through the vents and all of a sudden guys shoot me and shoot the uh, bottom of the vents and bullet holes come through it. Still doing down here. Get topside. I'm working Your on a troops Billy are Bob. Coming in to save us. Do you have any ammo? Give me a gun. What gun? No gun. Nothing. Okay. I won't kill you then. I remember the freezer section. Wow. 
lot of hits, buddy. around here. Where is it at? Because it moves the meat to move the meat thing. go. like that. <sighs> simple, simple, simple puzzles. But I remember when I first did it, it took me forever to figure out. I don't know why, but it's basic puzzles like that which are really hard for me. Maybe it's because I'm, I'm highly dys dyslexic, so basic little contraptions such as that confuse my poor little brain. Shotgun, that's where I've, I've missed my shotgun. That's what I like in this game. That and the gravity beam, but that's not in this game. It's only in Half Life 2. I'm not claustrophobic, so if I ever had to go in and jump into some vents like this, I would be perfectly fine doing that. <coughs> Freeman! 
Good heavens! You gave me quite a scare! Don't count on the cavalry finding us down here, Doc. We gotta head for the surface. But, with all the elevators out of order... We can still climb. Alright. Check your ammo, Doc. You got some chubby cheeks, boy. Man again. Wow, look, wow, even blood splatters on you. Wow. That's so lame. That would look nice in my truck. There's no way I can make that jump across that shaft. I failed physical education. You failed? I guess that means I'm playing babysitter. <laughs> His stare is like, you calling me a babysitter? I should put a bolt through your head right now. You're stupid. You're not scared, are you? Me scared, Gordon Freeman? I can almost reach it! Close. I... I can't hold on much longer! Well, I can help... I can help ya! Loading, 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 loading. Sitting in front of me is two Blu-ray, uh, I have a Blu-ray, the first Terminator movie, and then Terminator 2 sitting on my desk. I just picked them up from on my Blu-ray copy, as I love Terminator 1 and 2. Just thought I'd let you know. I'll be back. We've got hostiles. Oh, 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 this is the meaning we're getting to the surface. for us! It's our only way out! Oh my god! We're doomed! <laughs> okay, I thought if you shot those... not blow up? I was confident, at least in the other game. Oh, they, they're not explosives, so... Wonderful. I'm nearly dead already. Um. Yep, and I'm dead. Just like that. First, that's actually my first death. Well, no, it's not my first. It's my second death. 
but... I don't recall being I don't recall being able to roll grenades. Did you do that in the last game? I don't remember being able to do that, but maybe you could. Now these are the ones that blow up. Gosh, that scared me. I keep forgetting that I can do that, but... was an absolute fail. There's the Gmail again. Time. 
Where it gets fun if I were, yep this is where it gets fun I remember this is where we meet humans human contact but of course when that human contact is reached they want to kill us kill me it's like that for every game I play every time I reach humans they always want to kill me somewhat for some reason oh rescued at last Gun is finally here. Woohoo! The only bad thing about this gun is the aiming reticle is too big. It's too way too inaccurate from a long distance. I thought the guns were facing the other direction. Fail again. Alright, let's try this again, and hopefully I won't be as stupid as I just was. See, I, I walked over here, and it looks like that green, that green guy... I thought it was turned the other direction, but apparently not, so... Uh, my bad for being blind and stupid. You gotta be kidding me.
So clever. Now how exactly... Everything and you run out in public and die. Very smart move on your on your part, buddy. Looks like the revolver is really the only good gun against him right here. This, this gun isn't exactly... Jeez, scared the living crap muffins out of me. I hit the surface yet. Not yet. It's not. I remember I took forever um, in the original game to get to the surface, and I remember when I first saw light, I was like, oh my gosh, it's light! Light! Or is it? Or am I about to actually hit the surface? I don't remember. What's going to happen outside? Catching up. Yep. Sky.
he said he was gonna kick my ass. Well, that's a new AI improvement from last the last game. Well, so much for the government. Their idea of containment is to kill everyone associated with the project. Judging by your hazard suit, I'd say you were part of what went wrong. Isn't that right? I now look, if anyone can end this catastrophe, I don't think blaming it's the science is necessary team who land the at the opposite end of the base. With the transit system out, I couldn't tell you how to get there. But there's an old decommissioned rail system somewhere through here beyond the silo complex. If you can make it through the rocket test labs, you might be able to worm your way through the old tunnels to track down whatever is left of the Lambda team. You can trust them. You can trust all of us. I hope so, mister. Wouldn't you like to get blood samples under the microscope? Last pit. Always can use grenades. saw the, the outside for maybe about a few minutes and then we're back down on the ground again. Not my idea of fun, but I like to see the blue sky, get fresh air.
Nothing like green goo. Load, 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 Jeez. 
is a nice way to rack down my health. thing before it gets any larger. Just throw a grenade. One, two, three. You out of space, Octopus! Voila! Just like that. I'm gonna save it here because I have a feeling I'm gonna die. Freaking gosh, I am going to rip this monitor out of the wall. Wonderful. Attention. 
that's so awesome just to have those things randomly spawn out of nowhere and blow me off the ledge. Smithers went down there. I don't expect you to do anything. Hiding spot. I'm not moving. I 
Oh man, I'm pretty much screwed now. Nope, I didn't. Wonderful. No guns, no nothing. Well, I'm just gonna stop right here because this game, this is almost an hour, this is almost an hour, or actually it is an hour in length already, so, um, I'll continue on with another episode, uh, soon after this one. Thanks for watching.